Hi, this is Ryan Bates from RailsCasts. I have the pleasure of introducing you to a new gem called Passenger from Fusion. Now, Passenger comes with an Apache 2 module, which makes Rails deployment quicker and easier than ever. So let's get started. The first thing we need to do is install the Passenger gem by running gem install Passenger. Now, after you do that, you can just install the Apache 2 module by running Passenger install Apache 2 module just like that. Now this installation process is very helpful and easy to use because it walks you through step by step the full installation of the module and then the deployment of your Rails application. Now currently it's just compiling the module into my custom Apache installation and if it comes across any error messages it'll warn us about them and offer some suggestions on how to solve it. So there we go, it installed nice and clean. Now we just need to set up our configuration file. So we just copy these three lines into our Apache config. Here it is. Just copy those in there, save it, and then let's continue on. All right, so we now just have to set up our virtual host in our Apache config as well. And then we just point this to our Rails application. Now I have Rails cast site installed on here. So let me point it to that, deploy this application. All right, make sure to point it to the public directory of your Rails site. And that's really all you need to do. Just restart Apache. And that's it. So let's open up our browser and see if it worked. Well, there we go. This is our Rails site, fully deployed, Railscast site, fully deployed on our local host here. So Passenger is uh, very well documented as well. So I encourage you to check out the documentation at the path given. Just open that up, and it opens up in your web browser. Now, the uh, uh, I want to show you one thing here in the Rails documentation. If you run this command, touch restart.txt file, it'll actually restart your Rails application. So if you add that command into your Capistrano recipe, then uh, you can restart the app through that, and you don't have to restart Apache uh, every time. And also, here's some more configuration options you can set in your Apache config uh, for configuring Passenger the way you want. So that's probably the easiest deployment I've ever seen of a Rails application, and all thanks to Passenger and Fusion.